Welcome back, everyone. Lauren McLaughlin here at the APP Tour Pacific Northwest Classic Pickleball Open here in Bend, Oregon. For our special streaming weekend of APP Unplugged after the glory days of MTV and their acoustic sets by their famous artist, which were deemed unplugged. So our stream is today. Thank you so much for joining in this do what we can stream to bring you guys the awesome pickleball action here in the Northwest. Gorgeous day, a little toasty, nice and sunny as you can see. I believe in the low 90s for today here in Bend, Oregon. We have a men's pro doubles semifinal match coming up next here on Championship Court. We have Jocelyn Devilliers in the bright blue playing with J.W. Johnson in the teal. They're going to be taking on Austin Gridley, who is currently in the hat, and Shelton Jean Baptiste, who is matching the court colors beautifully in his kind of tan dark maroon brown outfit. I love it. Color coordination is key. Both Gridley and Jean-Baptiste hail out of Utah. Austin Gridley in Ogden, Utah area. He is 25 years old. And thanks to social media, I recently just learned that he and his wife are expecting a baby boy. So a congrats to them. Shelton Jean-Baptiste is out of Springville, Springville, Utah, 27 years old. And of course we have a Jocelyn de Villiers, currently lives in Wichita, 26 years old, but of course he is from just outside of Paris, France originally. He's playing with J.W. Johnson, who's from the Boynton Beach area in Florida. He is just 19 years old, but absolutely hangs at the top level of the pro brackets. Every time he plays, making a big name for himself, especially in singles. Actually, 
defeating Jocelyn de Villiers at the Beer City Open in Grand Rapids just a couple weeks ago, claiming his first ever gold medal in a pro singles. So a big congrats to him. I'm sure he is hoping to make a similar run. Sunday will be our singles day here at the Pacific Northwest Classic. Again, I'm Lauren McLaughlin. We're streaming exclusively on the APP TV YouTube page. So if you haven't already, go ahead and hit subscribe and that notification button and you'll get notified every time we go live as we're kind of doing this match by match. So feel free to share this stream with anyone that you know would love to see some amazing high level pickleball. And especially if they are rooting in particular for any of these four fabulous gentlemen. I am flying solo this weekend. Very happy to be here, but I'm hoping to have some great guests here helping me out as they become available. We'll be getting going here momentarily, so thanks for staying with us. Jocelyn de Villiers is actually joined by his wife this weekend. Extremely happy to see her. They are flying solo this weekend without the two little ones, so I'm sure they're enjoying a little adults only time. Of course, I believe the de Villiers family is watching online though, so we love having them joining and all of you guys as well from all over the country and the world, wherever you guys are watching from. Appreciate it so much. And as always, if there is any issue with the stream or the microphone or the camera, there's not a whole lot of bells and whistles going on this weekend, so I will certainly do what I can to enhance your viewing experience at home. We actually have on the court next to this one a senior pro men's match going on right now, so you can kind of see... We have Scott Crandall and Mercha Marariu taking on John Sperling and Dane Gingrich over there. So that will be a fabulous match as well. We, of course, are into the semis here in our men's pro bracket. So we are getting towards our medal rounds here. Our other semi is set as well with Steve Deacon and Spencer Smith taking on Wes Gabrielson and Eric Lang. All right, looks like Jean-Baptiste and Gridley will be serving first on our near end. They both have a very unique style of play, which can be a little awkward to watch, but I personally enjoy it very much. I find it very exciting, so hopefully you do as well. Shot Baptiste working out a bit of a spin serve himself. Put a point on the board, but De Villiers and Johnson have their chance now. 0 1 1. Excellent little Ernie there to start us off here in game one from Jean Baptiste. Oh, we got a ball on court. Zero, 
0-1-2, Johnson serving here in game one. Oh, rolls along that tape, drops just in. Johnson able to get there. One zero one Gridley also with a fun little spin serve version. Good attack there from Devillier. Gridley able to handle a couple of them, but the edge of his paddle. That last one sends it flying to the adjacent, adjacent court. One zero two. Good communication between Gridley and Jean Baptiste during that rally as they kind of scrambled around. One, one, one. Two one one. That one stays in as Jean Baptiste floats that over De Villiers. Three one two. Timeout called by Gridley and Jean Baptiste. It is 4 1 when we come back. De Villiers and Johnson out in front. The winner of this match will move on to our winner bracket final to take on the winner of our other semifinal match. That will be between Steve Deacon and Spencer Smith taking on Wes Gabrielson and Eric Lang, who are our two co-hosts of the weekend, both Northwest boys. This is kind of their home turf. Very happy to have them as co-hosts and excited to see them in the semifinals. Back from the timeout. Four one two. Johnson sends that serve long. One four one. Gridley, very excited about that. Two four one. And as you can see, it is P 
pure sunny skies here. It is, it's very toasty. There's a light breeze. I would say it is high 80s, early, low, early 90s. <laughs> low 90s, excuse me. So it is definitely toasty. These players definitely need to be staying hydrated. Keep those electrolytes up because it is toasty, but it gets very nice in the evenings as well here in the Northwest. Great spot there from Jean Baptiste right at De Villiers' feet. 4 2 2. A little body shot there from Johnson. Didn't put a lot on it, but didn't need to when you have such great placement. Gridley not even able to really react as that hit him. Everyone is very correct. The phone did indeed overheat. Um, it's got kind of a special case on it with a special lens. So apologies. Again, it is very hot here. Doing what we can. Um, I know the camera angle is not ideal, but just wanted to try and get us back up and running. We are starting game two. De Villiers and Johnson did win game one. So we've switched ends. I also apologize. It might not be the clearest picture right now as the phone is kind of hopefully cooling off. Hopefully before the next match, I will be able to get it cooled off a little bit more. 2-0-1 is the score here in game two. Also, if your quality looks bad, go to the settings and put it on the highest possible setting that you can stream on YouTube, and that might help. Zero two two. I agree, Fred. <laughs> the phone's dehydrated. Oh, 
Ooh, good Ernie there from Gridley. Better defense though from De Villiers. You guys still with me? Yep. Hang on. Excuse me. No worries. All right, guys. We cooled it off a little. Thanks, Kirk. Oh, you're good. Put the phone in the cooler. Lauren, when she comes back. Oh, there you are. Hi. Um, is there a way that we can somehow put a covering just like over this pan because it's going to overheat so much oh, you mean and like when I put the umbrella over it, it, it shakes because of the wind. So if we can just put break something like just across the corner. Let, me get, let me get Jim come and talk to you. Yeah, 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 perfect. Thank you. Guys, this is gorilla live streaming. That's what I have to say right now. All right, we are not done yet. We are still in game two. It hasn't finished. <laughs> Thanks for sticking with me, all the diehards. Threw the phone in a cooler for a couple minutes. Able to get it back up and running. It will go back in the cooler when we're done here. It's like the perfect angle right here if I... Okay, time in. Let me get the score. 8 7 1 is our score here in game two of this semifinal match. De Villiers and Johnson are serving. Jean-Baptiste and that puts us at a match point here, 10 7 one for De Villiers and Johnson. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, look at this little dance of the net. I love it. All right, there it is. <laughs> Hodith, how do you want to pick a ball date? Um, I I don't know what what should be the parameters. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Um, all right, guys. So, J W Johnson and Jocelyn De Villiers moving to our winner bracket final. I would go chat with them if I didn't need to throw the phone in a cooler. Our other semifinal match is coming up next. I'm gonna go put the phone away, try and cool it off, so we hopefully can get. Uh, 
that match without too many issues. If I gotta come stand here with it, so be it. But uh, we have coming up next Steve Deacon and Spencer Smith taking on Wes Gabrielson and Eric Lang. I'm gonna go throw the phone in a cooler and we'll be back with you soon. Thanks everybody. Yes, thank you.